welcome back to Cassie L Talks on the Indie Game Report. If you've ever been to a dinner party before, you have most likely sat next to someone that you didn't know, and maybe you had like nothing in common at all, and I bet it was a little awkward. So what if you turned some kind of situation like that into a game? In Find Your Seats from Button Shy Games, that's exactly what you're doing. Find Your Seats is a light filler game in which you are a party planner that has lost a seating arrangement and you now need to seat guests appropriately so they'll have something to talk about. Seat guests the right way and you might earn some points. Feeling hungry? Let's go take a look at Find Your Seats. All right, here is Find Your Seats. In the game, players are attempting to earn the most points by seating their guests in the best way possible. Guests seated near each other that share age or discussion topics may earn points, as well as guests with special abilities. Find Your Seats is played in two phases over the course of three rounds. First, all players will draft a hand of four guest cards. Once players have their four cards drafted, they enter the seating phase. In the seating phase, starting with the first player, players will choose one guest card from their hand and will seat their guest. Players are able to either seat their guest in the left, center, or right chair. Some guests may have bonuses or actions that will trigger. Once all players have gone around three times to seat three of the four guest cards they have in their hand, players enter the scoring phase. Players earn points for seating guests near each other that share topic conversations and or share age. Once players have figured out their scores, the round ends and a new round begins. The cards are swept up and shuffled and then cards are dealt back out to players. The player with the most points at the end of three total rounds is the winner of Find Your Seats. And that was Find Your Seats from Bud Jai Games. Lighter game, uh, really easy to understand. The background story is fun. Um, thinking about players having lost the seating arrangement for guests, so you gotta try to figure out what guests would go along with other guests. The story really only makes sense though, I guess in like, you know, the seating phase because Guests wouldn't really be, you know, drafted by party planners unless you're playing something like Fantasy, Find Your Seats or something. The art on the cards is really simple and the uh, card design, the graphics and everything are really easy to understand. The different characters are fun and the type of uh, conversations that the characters would have are really archetypal. Like the Andrew Burr only wants to talk about like the weather or have small talk. And the nerd also only wants to have small talk, but we'll also talk about hobbies and games. I like the interaction in the game where you have um, some of the character cards will affect your opponents, so you're not just playing a game by yourself. And there's a lot of strategy with the game where you have to figure out, I mean, your hand isn't going to always be perfect after drafting, so you have to figure out what cards will provide you with possibly the most points. But then again, you have opponents that might affect your cards, so there's a lot of interaction and there's actually a good amount of strategy considering how few cards there are to this game. Speaking of how few cards there are, the cards, there are only 18 character cards, so the game has, for me, it definitely has replayability. However, eventually, because there are only 18 cards, or eight, you know, 18 characters, you're going to see the same guests come back and forth, so it might get a little boring for you eventually but we might see maybe an expansion eventually. I would also be okay with an expansion that is about Find Your Seats, a cat party theme. So just putting that out there. Find Your Seats is a simple three to four player game, family friendly, easy to pick up, easy to understand. And it's a really nice filler if you're, you know, like waiting for dinner to come or if you're waiting for someone to set up Mansions of Madness or something. Find Your Seats is on Kickstarter if you're interested in adding it to your collection. There's information about that below as well as just more information about the game. For more information about the Indie Game Report, you can find us on Facebook and Twitter and also theindiegamereport.com. Thanks for watching. That's Cassie signing out with Find Your Seats from Button Shy Games.